Type thing for dinner. It's just uh, rice and beans at the bottom, roasted cauli excuse me, <laughs> roasted cauliflower, um, some romaine, cucumber, radish, pickled red onion, and then I just quickly cilantro lime dip. It's just sour cream, cilantro, garlic, um, olive oil, and salt, and I'm gonna drizzle that on. I just finished filming a TikTok that I needed to, and I'm gonna go get my hair cut now. This is what I'm wearing some La Causa trousers, my hokas, I don't know why it's so dark, um, a little black tank, and then I have a trench on with a sweater because I think it might be a little bit cold outside. But haircut time, long overdue. It's hot. Just finished getting my hair done. She did a great job. It's like a very, very long overdue cut. Same thing I always get done, just like layers. And a little bit of a trim. Oh my God. It's like actually roasting in my car, so I'm gonna head home and make a late lunch because I have not eaten yet. But, okay. Back from getting my hair cut and I just made super easy, simple lunch. I just, it's like a bed of leftover rice and beans and then Topped with some romaine, cucumber, corn, pickled red onions, and that sauce that I made. And then I have like a couple more work things I need to do. And then we'll talk. And then we will get to talk. Okay, I'm done eating my lunch and I've just been going over some to-do stuff on my iPad and I wanted to talk about the sponsor of today's video, which is Notability. And I have been using it like crazy. <laughs> if you're unfamiliar with Notability, it is a note-taking app. I'm sure a lot of people have are familiar with it if you used it in school. I think this would have been a huge game changer if I had <laughs> this when I was in university, but now I've been using it for like meal planning and bullet journaling and just kind of like keeping my life organized and all in one place. It has so many features. Um, Notability is free if you just want the app. And with the free version, you have like unlimited notes. Um, there's a couple different templates that are built into it that you can use like a meal planning one or like a food prep, which I have been using. So many features it has, but then you can also subscribe to the plus version, which 
is only $8.99 a year and it offers you a bunch more different templates that you can use, stickers, things to make it a little bit more creative. If you are someone who is in university, this is great, or someone who just likes something that's a little bit more, it's like a nice bridge between something that's like very tactile but still online so you can bring it onto your desktop or wherever and stay organized that way. I just have found this so nice to stay organized on my day to day. There's so many pen tool options on here and then you can like draw on it and get really creative and just like all different sorts of things and it's just like so amazing to use i mean there's so many more features on it that i just like don't even know how to do yet you can you can write it out so like say you can write notes and it'll instantly put it into typing so that you can write and then also have it really neat if you're someone who likes things to be really neat you can highlight things like you literally can do anything you want it's so, so awesome. And I have been like so obsessed with using it and like just using it to organize myself. And then on like the very front page, you can just like organize it into different notes that you have, like if it were for a class or different jobs or different projects you're working on. So very, very cool. Thank you Notability for sponsoring this. This is very exciting. And you can like record audio in here too so that you can listen to it as you're writing down so you can like kind of keep track of everything which is amazing. Um, just like really, really cool. Love this app, love what they've done with it. And then you can also, they have like a gallery of like templates that people have made that are really, really cool and people have just gotten very, very creative with it. I'm very impressed. So still a lot to learn that I need to like try out but if you are someone who has an iPad and is looking for something to you know like bullet journal with or just take notes with or have like to-do lists or any of the things that I mentioned I would definitely check it out and like I said it's free unless you want to subscribe to the Notability Plus that just has more templates and that sort of thing. I've been loving that. Go check it out if you haven't already. I'm sure there's a lot of you on here that have used this and if you are one of those people who use this in university please let me know. I'm really curious because I wish I had known about it sooner. It is now about five o'clock and I feel as though I have a couple more emails I need to do, but I'm kind of lazy. Also, remember when I had that like really evil spider thing happen like a couple weeks ago? Well, another spider just casually. There's his carcass. Another spider just casually walking across. I killed him. I had to kill him. I don't mess with those guys. So, yeah, I've been having some bad luck with spiders. I guess it's spring, so spider season. Sharing your life online is challenging. I will admit to you all it is. So just trying to find a good balance of what I feel comfortable with and what brings me joy but for right now I think I'm just gonna sit here or lay here I suppose on my sofa and scroll through Pinterest until I'm bored of that and then I will do something else I don't know maybe I'll play around with my notability a little bit more because I also have been loving doing that keep thinking it's Thursday it's only Wednesday Ooh, I could go on a walk. That might be nice. Diaries of a single girl who lives alone. I just want y'all to know that that spider carcass is still there on my floor. What can I say? I just... Parks of living alone, I guess. I got a stupid large package from Tata Harper today. So grateful. And I wanted to try something that's new to me, although I'm seeing now that it kind of exploded in transit, which is fine. We can't all be perfect. This is the clarifying mask. I have tried the resurfacing mask from Tata Harper and I love that one. So I'm, I have high hopes for this. Oh, it's really sticky. I'm gonna wash my face. I've been using the, um, this is annoying. I don't want this to be in here. Uh, I've been using the Youth to the People Super Berry Dream Cleansing Balm. 
I obviously put SPF on every day so I like to do like an oil cleanser or like something that's gonna emulsify my face and get is that the right word um, get everything off this is I don't know I give this like a 6 out of 10 my favorite cleansing balm is definitely still that turmeric one from true botanicals but I really it's good this one is good too but I if I if I could choose I would use that one but I have this so I don't even use it up and then the cleanser that I use it's almost out is the also you to the people kale and green spinach this is a great cleanser it's not knocking my socks off or anything but I like it I think if you had like more combination or oily skin you would like this a little bit more I feel like for dry skin it's still just a little bit too foamy for me but it is a good cleanser and I've been I mean I'm using it up but I think the next one I'm gonna try I also like the Coco Kine oil to milk cleanser if I'm traveling I always bring this because it's kind of like those two products in one um, I might throw in the Tata Harper Nourishing Oil Cleanser, or I did get one from Drunk Elephant too that I might try. So, yeah, my skin has been really, this mask right here says for problematic skin, and this has been a problem recently. So, I'm going to put the mask on. <laughs> Okay, I'm just going to show you the rest of my evening skincare since we've already gotten this far. So, after I rinse that mask off, I use this toner, which is the Laneige Water Bank Toner. I use this at night, and then I use my Isla Beauty in the morning. And then, after that, I spritz all over my Tata Harper um, Hydrating Floral Essence, which I love. Now I'm going to do a serum. I just use whatever serum that's next in the Roto. This one I'm using right now is the True Botanicals Repair Serum. So that is going all over my face. I do really like this one. But I think it's one of those scenarios that you'd really have to like keep using it to like really notice a difference. But I've loved everything so far that I've used from True Botanicals. And then I'm going to use a new eye serum or cream today if I can get it open. This one I just got sent from Aesop, which I have never tried any of their skincare before. I have only ever used their like hand and body stuff, so excited about this. Seems like kind of like an oil texture. So I'm just going to put a few drops on my fingertips and like tap that in. That's eye serum. I had been using the uh, Youth to the People Dream Eye Cream. Not my fave. It's, it's rich and stuff, but I don't know. Don't love it. Okay, and then my moisturizer, which I'm not, I'm just going to let my serum sit for a bit, but afterwards I'm going to use the True Botanicals Chibula Extreme Cream. I love this. It's like a whipped sort of texture. It smells amazing. Really, really hydrated if you have dry skin. And then I will either put on top of that the uh, Coco Kind Resurfacing Sleep Mask or the Drunk Elephant F-Bomb which is like a hydrating mask, so we'll see. I also have this Beauty Counter Overnight Resurfacing Peel that I haven't tried yet, so maybe try that soon, but I think because I did like a more intense face mask, I'm gonna do something a little bit more hydrating on top. Okay. Good night, y'all. Good morning. It's Friday. It's not Friday. It's Thursday. I It's about noon now. I've just been working all morning. I am now going to have a little snack. 
because I have a little bit of time before I need to go shoot something. My mom is gonna help me today. And then I think I'll probably, probably have more work after that too. <laughs> I was trying to think of something more exciting I was gonna be doing, but I think I'm gonna be uh, editing this video. I will be pleased to announce that I did actually vacuum up the spider this morning, so that's taken care of. Can you tell, my mind is somewhere else today. I don't know where it is, but it ain't, it ain't in here. And everywhere I go is the wrong place to be. I think I should go home, but I don't know where it is. Bring me back to me, me, me. Bring me back to me, me, me. Bring me back to me. time just finished shooting a bunch of content another youtube video that will be coming hopefully sometime after this one i just reheated my stir fry that i made last night i can't believe it's already 1 30 it has been such a chaotic day so many deadlines and just people to get back to organizing things with my family for my cousin's wedding and just all good stuff, but just like a lot and I've just been like constantly having to I've never been on my phone so much I think texting people and stuff. Anyways, I'm gonna eat my lunch and then I need to cut and run a couple errands and then I need to edit videos, so Lifestyles of the rich and famous minus the famous and rich